Check it out. This is the Sideshow Collectibles 1-6 scale Han Solo in Carbonite from The Empire Strikes Back. The greatest movie of all time, by the way. But yeah, this is a very, very nice piece. I picked this guy up at my local comic book store. One of my brand new, actually it wasn't a comic book store, it's more of a collectible store. My brand new collectible store here in town, here in Denver. So that was really nice. That was a really nice surprise to find uh, this kind of thing there. But it's a nice piece overall. Um, it's got a number of light-up features, as you guys can see, including on the side control panel of the carbonite block itself. Uh, it has a nice little light-up feature. A little bit of a pain in the ass on this one to pull uh, pull in and out and turn it on but I do believe it runs entirely off of standard batteries I believe triple A's so that's nice including the base here as well um, so there's the there's a little light up feature now on this the piece does have a couple uh, at least two different display options that you can display it in right now I have it in the carbon freeze chamber option which of course has the dark uh, paneling the dark floor paneling here and the orange light up uh, lights down there now I can convert this to more of a Bespin hallway display by just just by just doing the following check it out so as you guys can see, the carbonite base itself is held in place by this nice metal stem that does go down into the base of the piece and is held firmly, fairly firmly in place by a, it's a little bit of a, there's a little bit of a magnet magnet in there that uh, that holds this thing in place with this little square piece has a little, it's magnetized. Uh, the only problem I've been having is, uh, you guys can see some little, little white shit around the, the border of it. That's actually from the packing styrofoam. I've been wor slowly working it out of there, but uh, that's been a little bit of a pain in the ass, but anyway, not a huge deal but anyway so you can pull the piece right off and there is the carbonite block itself it's got some weight to it but it is fairly plasticky which is a little bit different than the uh the earlier rendition of Han and carbonite which came out from Sideshow collectibles a number of years back that was more of a jabba's palace display whereas this is more of a bespin display but this is more it's plastic but it's very heavy it's a nice firm plastic it's not like cheap ass styrene or anything like that so it's a nice mold i think overall um i'm not really uber familiar with uh, Han and Carbonite, how he should and shouldn't look um, as far as the inner aesthetics of, of, of how the piece should look, um, how the Carbonite block should look. But it looks looks like Han and Carbonite to me. So so all in all, the likeness is, is pretty, pretty nice there. But anyway, you can convert this piece simply by removing the stem here. And then the... Uh, the base here slides apart, as you guys can see. You flip it over, and there you got the Bespin hallway, that nice white color there, that nice white colorization. And then you just replace the fork in it with this piece here, and that slides in there. Real easy. All right, so there you go. But just by removing these two pieces here, and all of these panels are removable, and they have a nice, you know, slight uh, magnetic, uh, magnetic up. Uh, pull to them so they, they do click into place fairly nicely using using magnetism but as you guys can see it just kind of goes into those two panels there on the back that's sort of an eyesore you wouldn't want to display it from that angle obviously but it does look pretty good like this although i probably have it displayed the other way uh the base you guys all you need to do is slide out this orange foam there look at that it slides right in that insert there there's an insert for it slides right out real nice and then you get a nice whitewash uh light up effect there so that looks really really nice as well so there's a little look of the look at the piece overall um in this position it looks really cool like this um i'm not sure how i would display it like this because it's not exactly like this base is large enough to accommodate figures on it as well it's not like you can have um show you know the stormtroopers and boba fett and the bespin uh maintenance workers you know taking this to slave one it's not like you could fit that on that base there but uh, it looks pretty cool All right, guys, quick compare and contrast for you guys tonight. Here is the Sideshow Collectibles uh, earlier Han and Carbonite. Of course, this one has a Jabba the Hutt theme as it's with my Jabba the Hutt uh, collection over here, my Jabba's Palace collection over here. And then, of course, we have the Empire Strikes Back version I've just been showing off to you guys uh, from Sideshow Collectibles that is still available on their website, I believe, for $250. And that's about what I paid for mine that I picked up here locally. So there are the two pieces together. There's, I don't know, I think they're they're very, very similar. There's a little bit of uh, color differentiation in the newer one 
uh, while it, where the old one is more of a solid uh, a solid uh, dark gray this one has some some lighter uh, variants in it in the carbonite itself um, outside of the block but I, I don't know overall really really nice I'm pleased to have both of them in my collection that just makes me feel fortunate to be able to have both of these really great pieces in my collection and I definitely have Han and carbonite covered um, as far as my Star Wars collection goes so ah, you know pretty damn fun